Rubber isn't really rubber these days. Rubber has turned into an engineered polymer with elastic properties that allow it to be stretched and returned to its original shape multiple times without losing its characteristics under various conditions. These materials are built at the molecular level and have the ability to withstand higher temperatures and the forces of the cooling or belt drive systems. For the layperson, a belt or hose can withstand billions of trips around the pulleys or thousands of heat cycles from the engine. NAPA uses these engineered polymers for all NAPA belts and hose applications. Belts and hoses need regular inspection rather than replacement at mileage intervals. This is backed up by most maintenance schedules that use inspect more than replace. So how do you inspect a belt or hose? The first step is to understand how these rubber components fail in the first place. One of the most common enemies of hoses was electrochemical degradation or ECD. Modern hoses have improved polymers and layers that resist ECD. Today, what can age a hose is often external and is the byproduct of the tight packaging and harsh conditions under the hood. Even on larger pickups and SUVs, hoses are subjected to higher underhood temperatures to increase the thermal and aerodynamic efficiency of the engine. These conditions can cause heat aging, impulse fatigue, ozone cracking, compression set, and oil contamination swell. The close confines also increase the chances of mechanical damage if the hose runs close to a belt, transmission linkage, or exhaust manifold. Inspecting hoses takes a keen eye. Any damage to the outer layers can result in a loss of integrity of the hose assembly. Swelling is another sign the hose is starting to degrade. Also, any cracking of the outer layer is a sign the hose could fail. The inspection process for modern hoses is just as much about inspecting other components under the hood. For example, a worn motor mount can cause extra stress for the hoses that run between the engine and the radiator. Also, inspect the condition of the coolant. If the coolant is contaminated by oil or not the correct coolant, it can cause the hose to fail from the inside out. When it comes to inspecting a drive belt, the depths of the grooves indicate its health. These grooves grip the pulleys. If worn too far, the grooves on the pulleys will bottom and they will not be able to grip the belt. What about cracks in the belt? Modern belt materials are made of advanced elastomers that don't crack like older belts, but the backing is the one area of the belt that needs to be inspected. The backing is the smooth side of the belt that gives it structure. The materials used to make the belt are aramid or Kevlar fibers that are very strong yet flexible. When this structure is damaged, it could cause the belt to fail in the area of the defect or damage. This is why removing the belt to inspect the entire length of the belt for damage is critical for some inspections. Napa belts and hoses use advanced elastomeric compounds that can withstand harsh conditions under the hood. They also run smoother with less slip and wear for excellent belt service life and reduced pulley wear. The belts have a proprietary flex weave that protects the belt core from oil, contaminants, and heat for longer belt life.